Bonjour. Hi, everybody. I'm at the National Gallery in uh, London, just at Trafalgar Square, not very far from Canada House. And uh, I got to see some of the great masters, which I love. But one exhibit in particular that was very interesting was on Turner, especially looking at what's going on today. So Turner, between 1792-1845, um, he was, uh, he traveled quite a bit, and uh, for most of his adult life, 40 years of his life, Britain and his allies were at war with France between about 1792 and 1815. So travel was not possible. It was restricted. Sound familiar? As a result of it, he worked in commercial printing, um, he did all sorts of work for publishers, and then eventually, this actually helped with domestic travel, the idea of the, you know, the romantic travel, and uh, his sketches, his works were sought after, and this actually helped encourage travel and tourism. Eventually, when peacetime came, well, it, it helped with uh, better roads, we had better coaches, the steamship, the railway was being built, and as a result of it, his works were really, really sought after, both in Great Britain and in, um, in, uh, on the continent. And this actually encouraged tourism, that romantic vision that we see. So that was one of the most interesting uh, of the works. I'd actually heard of Turner, but never actually seen any of his works. The other thing he did is he wrote in his first will and eventually in his second will that all of his works of art, first it was two, then all of his works of art would be at the National Gallery because he believed that they should be with the great masters. And so they are. And I got to see them. There's also a temporary exhibit going on that's being lent here with two works of art and some of his sketches on travel, which were really quite... Um,